This one is quite challenging from a display point of view from the deposits of Steinkopf in the Northern Cape of South Africa. Now this one almost has a little bit of sea greenishness inside it, so we may be looking at possibly some chlorite inclusions. Matrix is a crust, almost a cast or a crust of quartz. On top of that, so if we have it at a, at a more logical angle going with a larger quartz crystal, lovely bright lustrous material as you can see on these sections, and then a mild dusting, a mild coating, perhaps a little bit of epidote on this one. I do need to look under magnification, so if you have it with a main crystal facing up, go around like this on a turntable, going through like that. Uh, for a flat display, this one may be more suitable for a flat display. Have a look at that color inside there. Sort of a, almost going into a sea green, which could be chloride inclusions. Of course, epidote also, uh, I find epidote from time to time on, on some of these specimens. Lovely piece. I wouldn't call it a floater. It is sitting on a matrix, but very, very interesting crystallization nonetheless. Double terminated crystal across here. So this crystal would be doubly terminated. Um, let me just get it back in focus. Sorry for this. Ah, oh, there we go. So there we have, is this one also doubly terminated? No, this one isn't. So the main crystal isn't doubly terminated, but this one running across here is. Um, intricate formation of quartz's lovely piece. All the way from South Africa, Steinkopf and Surrounds.